it's interesting. If you'd asked me the question um, 12 months ago, I'd probably have a different answer. Um, right now, globally, the biggest challenge that we're seeing is institutions adapting to what's a bit of a new normal. Um, so higher ed traditionally has not moved quickly to adapt new teaching modalities, new technology for the faculty-student interaction. And I think this has really forced everyone to through the pandemic. Um, so that's been a massive shift for uh, the industry and a, and a big place where Microsoft has been very focused. Um, but I think after we sort of went through a response piece there where Microsoft Teams became our platform, um, we've looked at the kind of the back end and the other areas where uh, higher ed institutions need to be thinking about how they're going forward in the future. And we've gone deep into systems for analytics to look at student success and student dropout rates. We've been working with uh, universities on how they look at student recruitment and student retention and trying to apply analytics and AI to improve outcomes there. Um, and one of the key areas that we've been working with is researchers as they look at you know, how do they shift their workloads to the cloud and continue doing research even though it's remote. Um, so it's been pretty holistic from the Microsoft perspective. Absolutely, a few key areas. I think one of the main areas where we saw a massive shift was really in faculty readiness and being able to help faculty uh, adapt to kind of a new teaching model and leveraging the systems that they have, like learning management systems, but then also having these all these new tools that are in their hands. Um, one of the things that we saw was this rapid grab whatever tool you know and start using that. And I think as people have started shifting and, and looking forward, they're starting to consolidate and think about what's the right platform versus what's the platform I have at my hand. Uh, so as we go through that, we're looking at how does you know, Teams and the Microsoft Office suite really become something that's a tool for doing teaching and how does it become more integrated into that process and using analytics and other things to gauge student engagement. Um, to really think about the learning process holistically and how that's going to be impacted. Um, so that's been a huge area of focus for us. 